uh, as a woman leader, very often we are told you're not feminine enough or you're too feminine, you don't smile enough or you smile too much. I'm Connie, I'm the President Director for Danone Specialized Nutrition here in Indonesia. If I wasn't doing what I was doing now, I'll probably be a painter, not a very good one, but I'll be experimenting and quite happy painting. Uh, that I actually have the time to paint every weekend. Let me think, that was probably last night when I was trying to figure out how to cook bamboo shoots. I think during the pandemic, everybody is impacted. Women and children in any pandemic are impacted even more. First of all, if you're a career woman and working, you have to take care of the family, you have to take care of homeschooling, and therefore it is a very demanding uh, because of that multiple role. And there is also a sector of the um, society where family may have lost income or lost a part of the income. And at the same time, the woman has to take care of the family. And therefore, that creates an additional burden for her. During the COVID, people were searching a lot. They were searching a lot for health. They were searching for words like immunity a lot. Uh, and also during the lockdown, they were searching about homeschooling. They wanted to know about stress because mothers and children were facing uh, stress during this time. So one of the things that we um, did during this time is really to stay relevant for them. So to provide them with the content, the information that they need. I think one of the things is that there is in the world and also in Indonesia, not enough women in executive position. As a woman leader, very often we are told you're not feminine enough or you're too feminine, you don't smile enough or you smile too much. So you're always having to walk that tightrope between expectations and aspiration. And men don't get all those um, questions or all the time or comments all the time. Uh, at the same time, I think um, women are inspired to be role models, women are inspired um, to do what they do so that more young girls can uh, dream their dreams and um, have a career and have a multiple role as a mother, as a wife, or as a woman, as a, career, a successful career woman, if that is what they want. I would say um, find out what you really love. Uh, spend your time getting really good at it and then learn, experiment and keep doing it until you continue to be very good at what you love and then um, don't stop until you get bored with it. Then you find the next thing you love. <laughs>